Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley says his government is committed to working with non-governmental organizations for the reduction of crime and delinquency in the country. And as such, he commended one NGO, Vision on Mission, for its efforts on the rehabilitation and reintegration of ex-prisoners, deportees, and juvenile offenders in the society. Sherilyn Lewis reports. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley commended Vision on Mission for their dedication to reforming the lives of ex-prisoners and deportees. The Prime Minister said the work Vision on Mission is doing is helping this country. I want to applaud the ongoing work of Vision on Mission, which in its own way is one of the crime-fighting mechanisms we have available to us in this country. And I know that they work very closely with the Ministry of National Security and other government ministries and agencies to reduce this recidivism in our country. Dr. Ali said the process of justice is not completed when a person is incarcerated because many people sent to prison are not sent there for life. He asked what's the next step for them when they are released and how would the rest of the population react? At some point, they would come to the end of their sentence <coughs> and will be released to rejoin us. What then are their next steps and what then? is our reaction. To this end, the Prime Minister said support will be given to NGOs whose focus on curbing crime and criminality in the society. We continue to partner with many NGOs like Vision on Mission to operate programs that provide social assistance in a meaningful way, confident that we are impacting very significantly on the lives, particularly of those persons who are least able to help themselves when they are least able to help themselves. The Prime Minister was speaking at the Vision on Mission Board of Directors inauguration and awards ceremony on Wednesday night. Sherilyn Lewis, C News.